Hello everybody, how nice to see you again and again. Look where we are with our dearest friends. This lovely girl is standing and getting ready for this beautiful, beautiful show that she brought some sort of cocktail. I haven't even seen it before. Look. So this is called Bloody Moon. Whoa, whoa. Is that gunpowder? <laughs> it's cinnamon. It's oh, cinnamon. Yes. So what's what's in there now then? So this one is 69% of rum. Good. Okay. I will put it out. Yeah. Yes. So this one you let to cool it out. And then after you drink it with the rest of the cocktail, this one is dry cinnamon, pineapple and orange. Okay. 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 For the blood moon. So we're yes. gonna have that in a cocktail, which is called now though. The, Enjoy blood, moon. Your the blood moon. Thank you very, Thank very much you. indeed. Thank and we're on the race terrace, by the way, at the Amavi Hotel. Let me just quickly show you the view because the view is to die for, especially at this time of night. The sun has gone, everything is looking blue. That over there is what we call the beach bar anesthesia. And of course, that's the snake. And I hope you can see there's a couple walking right really? up because they are going to cast their eyes out into that blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. Oh my goodness. Oh, no. so they're all chattering in the background, by the way. This is where we are, on the wow. terrace. We've got Princess Valentina. Of course, we've got Lord Analdo, his very own French beauty, Lady Sylvie. And of course, I've got mine, Miss Archie Grisilla Booth. The America. Well, we've been, you know, when once you see something, somebody and something, so you get in conversation and you get in love from the first time, from the first sight. This is what happened to us. And we remember how we met first time. It was amazing. Uh, we went for a dinner. We then uh, talked and then we become a best friends. And I don't think this friendship will ever and I have a feeling it won't, but I remember before you even met Marika, you messaged me and we met for coffee. Do you remember? Right. Myself and Sylvie, yes. we met at the Atlas Coffee up there. Yep. Analdo and Sylvie. That was the only time we saw you with that fancy Jaguar. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. After that, I don't know what you did with it. It's just reminded me about the, the Jaguar. The cheater thing. The cheater That's thing. It's cheating all the time, it Analdo. Is, it is, it is. It's, it all it's, broke it's, down. It took him six months to fix it. They broke yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, exactly, exactly, well, you're right. You told me not to get a Jaguar. I'm sure people are making fun of me. <laughs> yeah. She said, stick to Mercedes. It's oh, Mercedes. Yeah. I did tell him to buy Mercedes and he's bought a Mercedes. <laughs> what do you think of your dad's Mercedes? Oh, it's great. It's not bad, is it? It's a nice car. It's a nice car. It's a nice car. It's great. Do you drive, Sylvie? Yes. Uh, <laughs> Once at the end of April, I tried a few roads. Yes, I'm, I'm still not completely comfortable driving on the, on other the wrong side, side of the road. Yeah. Ah, of I course, think yes. The other side. <laughs> you know, I'm not being provocative. I'm saying <laughs> oh, yeah. on the other side. You know, I'm being careful. Yeah, I get that. It is a bit confusing. I think the biggest problem was when you come to a crossroads and you want to go the way you want to go, yeah, and of course you're not supposed to. Yeah, that's right. That's right. On that word of warning, because that's quite happens a lot in Cyprus. A lot of Europeans, shall we say, are here, and they think they're driving on the wrong side of the road. Because but they're not, are they? Because we're British. Most people are watching are British, and we are driving on the correct side of the road. So let's take you for a quick walk. Come on, let's go and have a look. Oh we'll leave them to chat as it's I show you nice. some of the beauty yeah. and some in of the spectacality the in this hotel. America, that is one of the entrances back into coffee. the main foyer. And of course, We're the bar is on Europe. the right hand side over there. Mm -hmm. like and this the is that rather nice Very little nice. mini <laughs> pool. <laughs> and it is a fabulous, fabulous <laughs> pool indeed. Look at that. Five star <laughs> luxury hotel oh, what's his right in the heart of downtown Kedipan Foss. And at some point, okay. You, uh, you mentioned apparently you were being bothered by somebody who was just tackling you, you know, as being insulting. And there's a beautiful and, uh, breeze tonight, by the way. We're coming to the end of uh, August, if you follow the channel, and the weather changes and Paphos in particular becomes absolute paradise. That is a sapphire pool bar, and of course that is a rather nice pool. Straight through the palm trees is the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, and of course the coastal pathway. And if you go left, 
along He's the coastal pathway artistic, for around about what 15 20 yeah. minutes you'll find yourself on Rickos Beach if you go right around about 15 20 minutes again you're going to find yourself in the downtown Pre 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 Harbor. Mm. now we're going to have some bites yeah. to eat in a few yeah. moments Prepared. so let's go back and join ago. our for example of friends. We're on the race yes, it is. The Amavi Hotel so we are talking now Pedro together. Backwards. He's a poor and one, the poor one, gone around the Amavi Hotel, run three circles around, and we are talking. Mr. Paul, do you know that Valentina just noticed and she said, Is your mic is working? I said, Yes, what's wrong with you? I said, This poor one, Mr. Paul, ran around, uh, made three circles, circles around this hotel. And we are wor uh, talking. Still chitty chatting. Chitty chatting. <laughs> but this girl is pretty clever. She understood that if Mr. <laughs> yes, if Mr. Paul is going yes. now and showing us the place around this Amavi place, the one mic should be switched off. Yes, this uh, it's well, not my fault. This rat is, is jumped on me and this sit. <laughs> but those of you who follow the panel, panel who it's follow the channel, fault. no. The does it. Was talking, it was recording. Was it recording? Well, you'll be quite silent, so I'll give you that mic. What do I do with that? Just, just hold it. Fine. Just, hold it. just yeah. eat it. <laughs> just eat it, yes. You can dip it inside the bloody So what, what do I do? I'm Are loving you recording? this moment. Can you talk? Can yeah. you talk? Just hold it about there as you're doing, and that's fine. Perfect. You'll pick yeah, up. It. Okay. And then when you talk to Ronaldo, move it to him. All right. Oh, as right. if you're taking an interview. Yeah. Interview, yeah. Mr. So we're going to interview them. Oh, no. There's Ronaldo. He's thinking, oh, no, he's got me again. <laughs> so, uh, well, I was telling Marika that in the last video about Marika and me, and you were mentioning apparently somebody who people are just kind of bothering you on the channel. You and uh, you said... No, but they're yeah. not being uh, nice. Pleasant. Pleasant. And uh, you said, yeah, it sounds easy to make uh, video, uh, video, uh, YouTube videos. And I was kind of thinking, and Valentina agrees with me, no, you look, uh, you make it look easy. Yeah. It's not easy it's not. because you are so articulate, you have charisma, you present so well that it sounds so natural. Yeah, You're yeah, natural. Yeah. But it's not that easy because. Not, it's not easy to speak in front of a camera, right, Valentina? Mm -hmm. Valentina. No, it's not this not is a point that a lot of people Take the little rat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's Valentina. Hello there. Set up blog as well, by the way. <laughs> oh, take it away, Valentina. Um, yeah, so um, I'm already uh, live streaming on Twitch, actually. Good. Um, <laughs> Can I say my channel name? Yes, <laughs> of course. Of course. <laughs> so um, I live stream on, on, on Twitch. Um, I'm called Scripty Shake. Um, <laughs> Do I have to do like this? Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, I live stream on Twitch uh, on Script T Shake, um, and I live stream um, uh, um, game, game development um, and art, so drawing, 3D, all of that kind of stuff. And sometimes I also um, I also do IRL streams. Uh, for example, I did an IRL, IRL stream when I went to TwitchCon this year, which was really cool. Let's get this clear. I understand a lot of the clever people understand what you're talking about. What <laughs> is the actual channel name, and you do it on Twitch, is that right? Yeah. Okay, live so on stream Twitch, on Twitch. Live stream yeah. on Twitch. Yeah. And what's the channel name? Scripty Shake. Scripty Shake. Yeah, all so one word. Scripty Shake yeah. on Twitch. If you want to come and meet Valentina, <laughs> please, please do. Because she is going to take you on her adventures. We have a good chat about this, haven't we? On her adventures through her life. So it's going to be a day in the life, basically. <laughs> well, that would be YouTube. <laughs> so you're going to have a YouTube channel as well. I also have a YouTube channel. I just need to revive it. Revive <laughs> it. Now, you're a game developer. Yeah. Or you're training to be a game developer. Yeah. Yeah. I'm currently in my third year at university. Yeah, so you're almost um, done. Yeah, I mean, I have. Still two years. I still have two years. <laughs> there we are. There we are. Yeah. And how does it feel? to now, because you've been living in Amsterdam, hasn't it? In Breda. Breda. Yeah. For how many years? Three years? Three Two years. years. Two. <laughs> this year is your final year in Amsterdam? No. 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 It's the um, third year and fourth. Right, yeah. so this, I'm just going to hold the mic to Ronaldo, because he's the man who knows exactly. <laughs> well, he's the guy who pays the bills, yeah. Actually, I'm coming to you, he's the man that's paying the bill. That's how he understands it. Well, it's it's true. Two more years, or three more years of hell. <laughs> two more years of budget. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. So. As, as everyone talks, just it's pass the mic. 
Okay. Because this is live at the event. Yeah, yeah, this is a. Uh, this is the... obviously our Lord Ronaldo. Yeah. He is footing the bill for his princess, <laughs> as dads do. As dads like, do. Out of Paris, so she's going to make lots of her own money. And you never know. In his own oh, age, she'll be, she'll go. He may get some support from her. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? You can never say, right? Probably not. But you never know. You never know. never you say know. never, as they say, never right? Know. Never say never. There's no doubt, and I'm not just saying it. No. Valentina is definitely. Princess. Yeah, of course. Yeah. She's my princess. Yes, of course. <laughs> There's not many men who would not want a daughter <laughs> as clever as Artie. I believe so, yeah. How many languages <laughs> do you speak? Go. Come on, tell us. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, I speak three languages. So I speak English, French, and Italian. And Is that all? I'm learning, I'm <laughs> learning Japanese. And she's she's only Japanese, young. So <laughs> not bad. And how old are you, Valentin? Eh? I'm 20. 20. Not bad. Oh. <laughs> now, obviously, the French comes from living in France. The Italian, because your father's Italian and your grandma's Italian, and obviously the English, well, you learn that along the way. Absolutely. Yeah, I was, <laughs> yeah, when I was about like, well, you know, throughout childhoods, but then I think I, I was really fluent at around 9, 10, yeah, and then 10. I went to an international school, so. Yeah, international school. <laughs> yeah, and YouTube. Yeah, 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 yeah that, absolutely. Yeah, <laughs> I've, I've been doing YouTube for ever since I was 11, actually. <laughs> but. Yeah. I've noticed this, the amount of people that I've met, yeah. Yeah. and I say, my God, your English is good, and they say, yeah, I watch YouTube. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no, no, absolutely, absolutely. I learned YouTube through, uh, I learned English through YouTube, absolutely. Yeah. Because yeah. your dad, if we pass the mic back to him, you went to boarding school in the UK, didn't you? I went to boarding school, uh, well, let's not say boarding school, I went to international school in Singapore. In Singapore to start with. In Malta yeah. and the UK. Yeah. Hence, the English is well, perfect. It's pretty good. Yeah. Slightly American, because... Yeah, you As I grew up in Singapore, you know, you just turn to watch American television, yeah. you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But your English is perfect. Yeah, it's pretty good. But with all respect, if we pass the mic to Sylvie. Of course. Sylvie's English, and I love the little twang, by the way. The little <laughs> Frenchy twang is beautiful. Where did you learn your English? Because of him? No. At school. At school. school. French school. Right. I, I, I always loved English, but I learned it at school because I went through the French, the French uh, school system. And they teach English? Yeah, I'm beginning sure. at 11, like 11 year old, I began. It was my first foreign language. And then, uh, and then I, I kept going on. And then I really, but then I went to the States. I was 22 years yeah, old for States. an MBA. And I remember I arrived at JFK and I just wanted a coffee, and uh, she had to give me back the coins, and I could not understand one single oh, word yeah, yeah, of the cashier. I said, "Well, it's New New York that's York going to be difficult." <laughs> and so for the and all the, the other Yanks. foreign, <laughs> the Yanks. She's the Yanks. and all the other foreign students were like me. Basically, for the first two years, I mean, in the MBA, it was we had to study a lot to just to be able to explain. Because you're an American or you're a foreigner, you just supposed to speak English normally yeah, that's yeah. it period and then you go through and then you have got hired and I, I had to 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 work in American firms so on and on and on and then you yeah. speak that's yeah. it English is perfect but well you still kept that nice little twang that well thank you Frenchy bit mm -hmm. which is the bit I love about Actually, it's that she so kept her little twang yeah, yeah. I must say when Sylvie I could listen to this woman for ages no <laughs> kidding come on no <laughs> And if if she's I sweet, saw right? she is she is actually she if I was a man a, she would. When she speaks English. She does not have a French accent. Believe me, you need to well, speak to French. So. Girl. He said I There's have a, a French. A twang. It is There's something. That's well, because he's not. He does not uh, it's it's <laughs> like a sort of cherry on the cake yeah. that okay. we say uh, that makes more beautiful your pronunciation and the uh, the way the way the way of talking is the same with the pronunciation. It's a pronunciation and style of maybe this national style of French people. I don't know how to I explain it, but it's confused. used to this. Well, if they I, if I say that I don't know. English is very, very badly spoken French, is that correct? Because <laughs> if we're English that. people, no, we would no, just say yeah. that French is very, very badly spoken English. <laughs> how do you say television? Television. 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 Yeah. Television. I guessed it. The question is, where did the word come from? 
I get a feeling it might be an American. Television. Yeah. Television. Mm. But, well, I think Italian says the same. Well, Spanish is the same. Television. Television. You see? Well, you have oh, vision. 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 It's yes. Vedere. Uh, in Italian, vedere, voir, uh, the view. Vedere. You know, it's uh, all. You know. This is the Latin part of English. Correct. Yeah. Okay. Correct. That's what I mean. Correct. This is the Latin That's part correct. of English. And that, oh, you said one thing the other day about vitrine. vitrine. The word vitrine. And you said, yes, it's an old English word. I said, no, <laughs> it's not. English. I no, said, no, it's, it's French. I know it's not an English word, but it's a word that my grandmother would use. Okay. Ah, oh, really? Really? Would probably not have used really? It, yeah. Because it's a very common word this is the window in front of the shop yeah like and a when you, you you want just to go shopping and look at what's inside <laughs> you say on va faire les vitrines oh wow on how nice vitrines. you go shopping on va faire les vitrines oh, really not just meat right i know what it is he's a bit of an idiot but he's got a blonde beauty right no, but we have an agreement, Marika and me. Yeah. Marika and me. Yes, of course. Uh, Correct. Yeah. That we're going to learn yeah. languages. Languages. So Sylvie's going to learn and Greek, Greek, and I'm going to learn eventually French. What about Italian? <laughs> Uh, later. <laughs> later. One later. more, because French is my native language, so obviously it's easier. So she can teach Italian, I, I can. I speak Italian, yeah, but Italian. to be able to teach it, mm -mm, that's going to be a bit yeah, I'm not going to be... Yes, yeah. yeah, my mother tongue. Yes. I'm not going to be very, should I say, askful. I know this word is not exist. Valentina is laughing. <laughs> I'm so funny. Uh, askful, I mean, I'm, I will not pretend to speak that language in a high way or in the way uh, what I speak English. Why? Because I'm quite too old now to... No, you're not. No, you're not. The you are. You know, you know the, there is... The words... we, we just watched a movie with Valentina, a sci-fi movie called Arrival. And at some oh, yes, point, yes. they have to decipher mm -hmm. an alien language. And so there is a whole of thinking about languages. And someone they say, when you learn a language and you go full steam ahead, you know, completely in the language, you rewire your brain in order and you begin thinking differently. And now, knowing that you speak seven languages, yeah, I mean, to the perfection, <laughs> Do you imagine all the the wires, the rewiring the in of, of the neurons in your brain? It, mean, it means that you reach a subtlety in your way of thinking, of appreciating the world, that you're going to see many, many things from different point of views maybe. that a person who speaks only one language, maybe two or three, won't see. You know, so rewiring the brain. So, I mean, and I agree with you when you say she speaks seven languages and she's a very clever woman. Mm -hmm. Believe me, she is. <laughs> she <does not. laughs> no. Is it okay? God, no. For Excellent. me, not. Absolutely fantastic. <laughs> now, we are going to have some nibbles. So, yeah. I'm pondering if they're coming. And I got a feeling that they're on the way. Because they don't want to disturb your YouTube yeah. video. Yes, anyway, they probably don't want to. Uh, I do have a question. Oh, okay, well, that's all right. So, the bites are coming slowly. <laughs> so no. I have a question. Um, yes. So what about my accent? <laughs> beautiful Your accent. accent is beautiful. Very American. Yeah. Accent. American it's got some accent. Dutch with, yeah. <laughs> it, it doesn't. What I was going to say is it's, it's very Americanized, but with something else. And yeah, you so, just said yeah, Dutch. She, she's she's is, been like yeah. two years in, in yeah. the Netherlands, yeah. and you know, even <laughs> they listen to people, and there's this yeah, Dutch accent as well. Because, you know, Dutch, they speak a lot, everybody Principal. speaks English, so, yeah. but they have their own uh, kind of accent, you know, so. and being there with the university, with the friends and everybody else, uh, I, can f I can hear it. She can't hear it, but ever since she left two years ago, she comes back, I, I hear this inflection coming from the, from the yeah. Dutch. We do. We, do. <laughs> we do, we do, we do. So, Valentina, that's what your accent sounds like. Yeah, very American, and I mean very yeah. American to my ears, okay, but yeah. there is something else. Yeah. I, I was trying to put my finger on it, and your dad's just said, yeah. It's the Dutch, yeah. because they speak uh, yeah. very clean English. 
or the ones with an accent. Yeah, but well, with an accent. Mm -hmm. And accents. then you've got the Americanism on it as well. Yeah, which may so come from your dad. <laughs> it may come from your dad as well, you see. Um, well, possibly. But so yeah. when I went to school, I, I did like the American section. Mm -hmm. So I did have like American teachers yeah, and yeah, also just true. YouTube yeah, is a lot of is, American English. The English, okay. take the something out of it, it's still yeah. very clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's the point. That's yeah. how. For example, Valentina's English is clean. We've got an American strong accent, but the English is clean. Again, yeah, there's the Frenchism, but your English is clean. Oh, is very clean. Marika, your English is clean. Yes. But what is inside? <coughs> what is inside? You said in Sylvie's is Frenchism. In mine? In what? yours, I think it's Russianism. Russianism. Because of course that's your mother tongue. And I've yeah, this is where I grew up yeah. actually. Russia. Maybe, no, maybe. Yes, yeah. no, you said no, that. Yeah. For you, listening to your videos, with Paul or just with your with your channel, it's basically that you haven't yet picked up no. certain words that are typical no. English. Mm -hmm. You do something like a direct translation from from, exactly. from Russian or from whatever. Yes, other language many you times, have. many times. And I sometimes when you do a direct translation, it's not the right word. No, but that's no. not a problem. You, you yeah. it's clean. Mm -hmm. You understand it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But when you're on show, you have yeah. to <laughs> only, only use that's the right buzzwords if you want. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well. Only that's why I'm saying I never had enough vocabulary, so amount of words. Yeah, I never it'll had. It'll come. It'll I all it will come. Especially uh, with Mr. Paul, I, mean, I you need cannot a miss lot. it. Yeah, <laughs> he but knows all the words. <laughs> I know many other words. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes trying to do to to be correct, and uh, I don't know how I managed to say it incorrect. Shall we say a big big goodbye? It's not that easy. I mean, you, you began a new channel yeah. and uh, for half an hour, basically, you are able just to entertain us yeah. in English. <laughs> and it's, uh, and uh, there is humor, there is um, many thoughtful uh, things you say and, uh, you know, it's another language and uh, you made no, so much you, progress. Yeah. So thank you about that. And you know what? I will, of course, improve it slowly, slowly, very slowly. I'll go up. What do you want to say? I'm, I'm going to say that in, in, in your channel, there's a lot of Marika. Yeah, it's me. It's, it's me. Nobody can disturb me. No, Nobody. it's your personality and yeah. you can see you're in your mindset. You're in your... Yeah. Uh, you yes. don't hesitate or stop or have yes. breaks. You yes. just know it's just going on and on. I know. It is true. Hello. Thank you. It is true. I'm quite, right? I'm quite thankful, thankful about it. Thanks for watching. Yeah. When thank the food you, comes out, you, we're going to make a little video. Oh, Correct? thank you very much. Yeah. We're loving the company tonight. <laughs> and thank you for everything. Thank you for watching and staying with us. We enjoy the company of our dearest friends. What can be better? Loving and kissing you from the bottom of our five hearts. Thanks very thank much, you. Sylvie. <laughs> Say a big, big goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs> we're enjoying so much this evening. Thank you. Such a beautiful <laughs> evening. Arnaldo, another yeah. big goodbye. Now, now we're going to hit the blood moon. <laughs> the blood a couple moon. of other drinks that are coming along. Yeah. Then so we'll be in a different mood after. <laughs> yeah. Valentina? Yep. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> Thanks for watching. And of course, we look forward to your company again very, very soon indeed. I'm just going to take you to that little place and it's show you again just how beautiful it is. Around. Yeah, yeah, but that's him. <laughs> And don't forget, if you do like what you see, hit the like, smash that subscribe. Please don't forget to keep on coming back for that little bit more of our complete and utter madness as we take you on our travels and, of course, our adventures in and around downtown Kedapafos. And now and again, we'll take you on some new ones. Thanks for watching, and we'll look forward to your company again very, very soon indeed.